Hey guys, this is Goldie again and in this video I will show you how you can create Gmail spam filter which can actually detect uh, Cyrillic characters or the languages which are used in Russia and some other countries. Now the use case uh, that I have is recently we have started getting a lot of uh, spam emails and uh, they are coming from different email addresses and different domains so I cannot just create uh, a filter which will only look for certain email addresses or the domains because these are pretty dynamic every time it's coming from new email address or the domain name. One thing which has been common in all these spam emails is that they are in Russian language or Russian characters. So there used to be a language uh, filter in uh, Gmail a few years ago which could have detected uh, languages. You will just simply create a filter by putting lang and colon and the language uh, short form like argue to detect Russian language and then you can dispose that email accordingly. But that unfortunately does not work anymore. So I reached out to uh, G Suite or Google support asking for help but they confirmed that there is nothing at the end user side which means in Gmail or in the administration console which can help me detect and dispose these emails accordingly. So I started working on this and uh, I figured out uh, how we can detect them and then block them accordingly. So before I go ahead, um, in my use case, I'm very specific to Cyrillic uh, characters of the script uh, and these are used in different countries, uh, including Russia, which is uh, my use case. So if you see here, uh, this is like a sample email, which I'll be taking as an example when we go ahead and uh, tackle this use case. So for that, now uh, before I move ahead, just a precaution that this will not work with Gmail. It will only work if you are uh, using G Suite, which is a business side of Gmail. And you should have administration uh, privileges for G Suite. Either you should be a uh, super admin or have enough delegated permissions. So I'm in my uh, Gmail then I will go to manage this domain which will take me to G Suite admin console and once I am in admin console I'll be looking for a content compliance uh, filter and I'm not sure why but uh, the search bar which is uh, meant to be detecting languages based on natural language processing but when I type content compliance it never comes up or I'm not sure if I'm missing something uh, okay so I will just click on uh, this to reach content uh, compliance filter and once I'm here I will go to content compliance and I will create a new compliance filter. Now you can apply that on the organizational unit that you have. In my case, I guess I just have one. This is my demo domain. So I'll type something like uh, detect uh, Russian emails. If this is required field, you need to fill that up. Uh, email messages to effect in my case it's just inbound because uh, we are not sending Russian emails internally so I'll just click inbound which means any email which is coming from outside my domain to my uh, users email addresses and then under expressions I'll go ahead and choose the advanced uh, content match and then I'll go to uh, message body because that's where uh, you will see these Russian characters usually so I'll click on body and then I'll click on match type which should be regex because uh, there is a regex which can detect uh, Cyrillic characters. Now obviously I'm not, uh, I know regex a bit, I can do like simple regex uh, stuff but not that much advanced. So I reached out to a friend who is indeed an expert in terms of regex so he gave me a regex which can detect uh, Cyrillic uh, characters. So here is that regex. I will copy this and then uh, come back to admin console put it here and let's test the expression as well so for expression testing I'll simply copy the message which I'm getting this is just an example and I'll put that in uh, sample data and let's see it matches which is perfect so even if I delete some of the stuff it still matches that means it seems to be working fine 
it is detecting all the Cyrillic uh, characters so it seems our filter is working fine it's, uh, it's detecting the filter so now I'll go ahead and uh, click save now I don't want to define the minimum uh, match count as soon as it's detected that's it so I'll click on save now I'm done with my uh, condition to trigger that filter now in terms of uh, uh, you know putting the actions I can go ahead and either send it to quarantine uh, to which means going to admin quarantine I can reject it which means that message will be rejected and it will not be delivered but instead of that I uh, want to modify it and you know just in case if we have any user in our domain who might care about these Russian emails so I'll, I'll click on modify message and I would click uh, on prepend subject and here I can uh, put something which can help my users identify that these these specific emails so that they can organize and they can dispose the way that they want so for that maybe I'll just put uh, Russian language emails which will be prepend to all the emails uh, uh, subject so once I'm done with this I'll go ahead and make sure that it's applied on all the users so I'll add that setting and don't forget to save it so once our content compliance rule is saved I'll go and uh, copy this uh, text which I know it's a really uh, character so the Russian language stuff and then I will go to my another mailbox and compose an email to myself to test it out so let's see let's call it uh, lang test and I'm gonna paste that to really character send that email and hopefully it should work when we get that email here uh, it should have subject prepended which it did so it seems this is working fine now for the users uh, it would be better if they can organize it so what I'm gonna do is create a filter with this so I will say if any email uh, has the subject which is this one create a filter and skip the inbox apply the label choose the label add a new label and let's call it uh, Russian language once create the label apply it create a filter so that is uh, it so now when I go and send an email uh, as a user so that would be now easy for user to manage it uh, another test paste it oops copy it and then paste it send it come back to this mailbox and that should come in this mailbox as it did so it came here which is uh, which is perfect as it working fine for us uh, if I go back to Cyrillic script here I see that in case if I'm getting uh, spam for any of these countries or any of these languages I can go ahead and block that if required uh, either write an admin console and don't deliver or in case if you really you know we are not sure if some of the users might care about that we can let them know that they can uh, you know, detect these by creating such filter hope it was helpful if you have any questions or feedback don't hesitate to put your comments below and I'll be happy to help thank you so much